well, um, well, hello everyone, and, and, and welcome back to, uh, another great episode here of, uh, you know, that, that Diablo, that, that Lord of Destruction or something like that. I'm being, uh, attacked by, by some ladies down here, and they don't seem too kind around here, you know. They don't seem to appreciate the fact that I'm trying to rid this world of their evil. Now they're killing me a, a good bit. It seems like seems like I'm not doing too good here. Well, there I go. I got the main boss. It looks like right there. Why am I not hitting you? There I go. Yeah, see, I I just needed to get a little bit closer to that lady. She was just she was just crazy. I don't understand. Oh, I just turned off my map, didn't I? I'm I'm a silly right there. I don't even know how that happened. Now you see, I gotta find my way out of this little cave here, cause if I if I don't find my way out of this cave, I'm gonna be lost. And you know what being lost is? It means you're not found. It means that, it means that you gotta find your way back, all by your lonesome. And I and I'd rather not be lost. I'd rather know where I'm going. I mean, I, I I like having a map with me everywhere I go. That's what you see right here on the screen right there. You know, you see like a little map right there, a little map that you can watch yourself. That's that's where I'm going. I'm I'm following myself so I can see where I am and I can see where my little help helper uh, Aunt Lisa is. And you know what? I, I I don't I like your name Aunt Lisa, but it, it's a little bit hard for me to pronounce. So I'm just gonna call you Amp. How's that? I was gonna call you Lisa, but uh, but Lisa seems too plain, and you seem like you're a fun kind of gal. So I I figure you might like it better if 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 I called you Amp. But we're playing with Bob right now, and you know Bob doesn't really know things. He's just running around hitting things with a stick. It looks like I don't think he even knows what he's doing here. He's probably just like now. Why in the world? Why in the world am I in this this damp dark this damp dark place? running around like a chicken with my head cut off i have no idea i'm just i'm just that's just how it works now i've seen places like this yeah i, I told you uh how i like to watch them documentaries yeah i told you i read about all about it you know like caves and stuff i i i read all about that kind of stuff because I, I told you i watched them documentaries on tv and they and they tell you so much. They give you so much information on uh, how you're supposed to go do things. I ain't gonna go over that way because it looks like there's a bunch of big monsters. And I, I want to just try and find my way out of here right now because we ain't got too much time to be playing around with this game now, do we? Now, Bob, Bob's got children to feed. He sure does. Bob has children he has to go feed. He's got uh. A grandmother to go take care of I mean he probably don't but we're gonna pretend that he does just for the sake of giving him like a little bit of a backstory you know he just can't go around saving the world he had to have been born somehow it looks like he ain't really wearing a, a, a belt anymore cuz he got it damaged but I haven't let him go back to town to fix it yet cuz he's strong look he's just taking an arrow right to the chest and he's just keep going with it I mean he's got armor on He's got his armor on, but I haven't seen anybody be able to take arrows like this man has. He's probably got scars all over the place. Look at us. We're just running around causing a havoc like you wouldn't believe. I just got to get out of here because these, these guys are going to get me good. Oh. oh, look at that. Have you heard his voice? He has a nice voice, doesn't he? Oh, and look, there goes Aunt Lisa. She's just leveling up like, like the champion she is. We're gonna give, we're gonna give that to her because I think she needs it a little bit more than we do, and uh, that's just how that goes. Actually, if we could just move this all out of the way, we could put this over here, and we could get that grand charm right there. Look at us. See, that's what you call. Uh, getting it to where you can go do things. That's what you call uh, handy right there. I couldn't think of the word. Silly me. We just went into a, a dead end now, didn't we? We should have we done went down that other way. I thought we was trying to 
to save on time, but really, really we didn't save on time at all. Not at all. And see, I'm doing it a little bit different now. Usually, whenever I'm, you know, making my way through a, a, a dastardly dungeon or something like that, you know, some kind of creepy crawly, you know, basement of some kind, I always, you know, go to the right because the right will take you one way and then the left will take you another. The left usually leads you further in and the right will always lead you out. Or at least that's what uh, I've always been told and it's not led me astray. But you see... I went to the left this time because for some reason whenever you're down in this underground passage is what it says up here we're in the underground passage level so I guess it's gonna take us out somewhere else so we won't end up where we came from but uh it always leads me the opposite direction like it'll lead me to the second level and set out well look at that it led me to the second level again I don't want to go to that second level right now that's just for people who want to um, level up their characters and get really good uh, gear. Because you go down those second levels, you get the level up, you get the monsters. I should have done, uh, listen to what, my always, what I always do. If I always, I always say you got to go the same way you go. Every single time it'll lead you right out. Right out the, right out the front door or the back door. One way or another you're going to get out. Now, these, these things, I don't know what they are, but you would think they'd have a hard life with, like, sticking their tongues out like that all the time. See, I don't really understand that. That seems like a lot of uh, hard work, always panting like that. They're like great big old dogs, aren't they? And I know I'm being a little bit of a, um, I'm being a, a little bit more of a chatterbox here. I don't mean to be. I, uh... I usually try and uh, stay pretty quiet through these. Except, look at that. Look at that. Look at what we found. We found the entrance, exit, whatever we found. We found it, and we're going to go back to town really quickly. So I can uh, get some of this stuff identified and sold. So I ain't carrying around the whole neighborhood on my shoulders. Because, you know, like finding all this stuff, they probably don't have this stuff back in town. They probably do not. No, sorry. They are wanting to sit here and you know let me go search for it and me go find this stuff for them because you know it's dangerous out there for them they're just common folk and well i'm i'm strong i mean look at him he is a strong guy and did you hear him speak earlier he has a nice deep voice i'm telling you we're gonna put these gloves on him because he didn't have no gloves and i bet his hands was getting cold so we're gonna get rid of that too and that we're going to keep this right here because it gives us 10 life. That's, that's actually really good. That's a good thing to have right there. What does this do for you in your armor? We need to get us a ruby is what we need to find us. Yes, sir. It's got to be a ruby. Got to be a ruby tooby. We don't need no... uh mana potions right now so i just sell those because those go for a good bit of a good bit of money and i don't know if you guys heard that or not but i feel like i just heard like a banshee or something like a ghost like it sounded like somebody screaming or a, a cat or something you know I, I don't even know what that was but it sure did it rattled me down to my core it sure did i'm i'm just terrified now I don't know if that was in the game or if that was uh, in real life. Because I got my, I've got, i got, you know, these new things. Uh, you're supposed to, you're supposed to wear them on your, on your head and they help you get, uh, you're supposed to, you're supposed to wear them on your head and they help you get uh, more into the game. They're, uh, they're called headphones, even though you can't make any calls with them. You know, I, I, I wish that'd be something, you know, you just put it on your head and then, if, you know, you say, I want to make a call. And so you just go and make a call to somebody. And that's how it works out. You, you make a call and then you, you're done. You're done. That's how, that's how it works. Now, I've got some resistances up now because I'm getting um, all this gear ready. And we're going we're gonna to get ready. We're going to get it done. I just got, you know, plain boots on, which is fine. Let's do this one here. And look at that now. I just made all those potions leave. 
I know I could do this the quick way, but I don't really feel like doing it the quick way. I just want to do it this way because I ain't got that many potions to throw in there. All right, now we're good. Let's get let's get a move on. Let's go back down in there. Let's continue on. Let me go ahead and open up another one just in case I I happen to run into some unsightly characters that I don't want to run into because it's going to be hard whenever I get over here. Because, I mean, you know, they're going to get stronger and stronger until I can't do nothing about it. Check us out. Look at this. We're getting good. Ooh. Now let's run away and let our health come back up. We gotta let that health come back up so we can get some whenever we uh whenever we need it to come back. And the more of these guys we take out, the less they'll hurt us whenever we're trying to fight the main one over there. Oh, did he already die? He already died. That was Amp Lisa right there because I was nowhere near that guy. That's all her that's all her doing right there. She is a genius. She is the best thing that I have ever had. She is a good friend. I can't ask for a better uh, teammate. That's what it is. I can't ask for a better teammate. She is like just the greatest thing that has ever walked between two slices of bread. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Walking between slices of bread. Now, I know we're looking for a tree of some sort over here. I, even though I haven't uh, got quite the, the slightest idea of where to find it, I know that's what we're looking for because I have seen Let's Plays of this before. But, you know, my name is Bob, and uh, we are going to go find some things. It might take us a good pretty minute, though. Okay, so I don't know. I had to sit up here for a minute. I don't know where anything happens to be, though. Okay, so that's the entrance over here. So we don't want to go that way. Well, now those animals there just are... They're just kind of mean, aren't they? They don't actually care if they, if they hurt you that bad or not, do they? They just... They just want to munch it down uh, yep see that's all Aunt police is doing she is a genius one of the best I've ever seen and it looks like I just got another level look at that 10 points just to go with my vitality check us out look at us finding all the kinds of secrets we are going to have walked around this whole entire place. See, it's no wonder that we're in such good shape right now. I mean, the fact that he's all strong like that. Oop, I found exactly where I was supposed to be. I did not realize that I had found where I was supposed to be. That was an accident. I cannot run away. Oh, Aunt Lisa has got something going for her. You see that? I would have just straight up and died if it was not for her. And she has some kind of magic find on her or something. Because she just killed that guy and he had all gold on him. This dead tree teems with energy. This dead tree teems with energy. Oh, I just like the way this guy speaks. He speaks real nice, doesn't he? I think he has a... Uh, he's just got a way about him. And it is just fantastic. I don't know what I'm doing over here trying to talk to Cassia. She's just standing there looking at us like we're just crazy. Why, thank you, Akara. That's real nice. Hello, Akara. Hello. How are you doing? I hope the children and babies are fine. I know you probably don't have any babies. You got a skull there in your tent, it looks like. I'm guessing that's your wares, though. It's probably one of those things that a, a necromancer or a sorcerer would use, or a sorceress, whatever you would want to call them. Um, it looks like I have a head in a jar. 
I don't know what that's for, but I'd like to, like, get that away from me as soon as I could possibly, uh, handle. That'd be nice. Okay, so, we, this one has two, uh, things in it. We're just gonna put that in there and then just sell this one. I know that that one would have probably given me a little bit better damage, but, you know, it's fine. And I'm gonna switch those shoes out for these ones here, because... Those ones there are gold, and I, I just can't. Re I just can't resist. I just need to have it. Well, this is for a necromancer, but I don't know any necromancers that'd be able to play with this. Um, simply because I'm not online right now, so I just get rid of it. And I put this other ring on, even though I don't need fast cast. I, I just put that other ring on. All right, look at us, and we are ready to go again. Let me sell this uh, light mana potion because I ain't got no spells learned yet, which is fine. We can learn them next time. Anyways, everyone, I think this is uh, this is going to be it for now. And I'm going to go rescue some man next time. What does it say over here? Go to the Cairn Stones in the Stony Field. I know where the Stony Field is. I just walk through there and touch the stones in the order found on the scroll of Enifus. Enifus? I don't really know what that was. It might be it might be spelled differently. The scroll of Enifus. I don't know. <laughs> it's Enifus. It's an Enifus trying to get there and get it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just I'm just pulling your leg there. It's just a little joke, a little humor between the two of us. Or, you know, between the bunch of us, because I don't know how many people are actually watching this, so you know. And then this says, Enter the portal to the Tristrum, but beware because the danger lies ahead. Well, you don't have to tell me that. You don't have to tell me that at all. Because I already know there's danger. Otherwise, I wouldn't be dressed up like this. I mean, I don't dress up in this armor just to look good. Even though I do look good in this armor. But look at this. It looks like my back is almost completely exposed. It might not be. That might just be my hair. But you know what? It looks like it. And, so, and then from the front, I kind of look like a transformer. Let me take this map down. Yep, I look just like a transformer from the front. Or like a a weird version of uh, Shredder from uh, those uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles mixed with uh, somebody uh, that evil somebody evil from uh, Power Rangers. I look like a mix between them, don't I? I sure do. Well, anyways, folks, I think that's gonna be all for now. I, I'll, I'll just have to catch you guys around next time. This has been a real treat. It has been a pleasure to come back and say hello to you guys. I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. If you did, you can always click on down there and hit like. It should be over here on this side. If you didn't like this video, well, why not? Why didn't you like this video? You could just click that dislike button over there, but that's how that works. They're both right over here. There's a like button here and the dislike button right there. But if you guys feel that you enjoyed this video enough to subscribe, please do. You can just click on that link down there in the description or you can just come right over here where this devil guy is like it's probably right on his face or in this little mana potion pot right here yep it's right above the like button and the dislike button and it's right over here in the corner you just click on that button right over here and i would greatly appreciate it and i know the owner of this channel jasmine she'd greatly appreciate it too she's been working real hard to get these videos out today although she hasn't really been working too hard because she's letting me come over here and play you know she's taking a little breather you know <laughs> anyways folks for more things that she has done you can always click on any of the links in the description and we all love you and i hope to catch you guys in the next episode and bob my name is bob i need you to come over here come on bob say goodbye bob say goodbye they're gonna leave everybody i hope to catch you guys in the next one bye now